feel by the wayside like everyone else. Graham we've just seen Volpe Veloce work, uh, your impression of that? It was uh, first class work, uh, just couldn't time it because of the fog but uh, Mick who rides her every day is just uh, absolutely wrapped up with work. Yeah, she looks really strong, how is she condition wise for you? Oh, she's spot on, like, um, you know her last run was very good, uh, obviously but she was four wide the whole way, it wasn't anybody's fault, just drew the outside and uh, hopefully we get a better draw this weekend. I know she's a bit of right, um, right-handed, but uh, last year she ran fourth in this race and just got too far back, so hopefully we get a little bit handy this time. Yeah, you were up against some guns, but uh, she's that quality. Uh, how does she measure up this weekend for you? She's on target. She's looking well. Um, as I said, Mick was happy with her work, and uh, she had a bit of a blow, but she's spot on. Where's this race fit into her preparation? How much further do, into the prep do you go? Obviously, Tiara is, uh, is the final draw card for her. She'll be retired after that. Uh, and I've got to confirm that with the owners, but uh, I'd say that's what we're looking at. And um, that would be nice to win a group one there too. So uh, she ran fourth in that as well last year and just trained off after that. She's a bit tired after that. So, But um, more than likely will be her last season. And... Um, after that, we've got to sit down and work it out. She's been a great horse for you, though, Graham. Amazing, amazing thrill. You know, one of her first seven starts, and uh, it was nerve-wracking, but um, it was it was uh, surreal. It was just unbelievable. And, and there's been races where she should have won as well, and she's won 12, and she probably won, should have won more.